Hey, good morning everybody. Welcome to the vlog. It is about 6 o'clock in the morning and it's an absolutely gorgeous day. And we have an absolutely insane day ahead of us. We're going to get started by feeding some big snakes. That's right, including my new albino Burmese python. So that is going to be absolutely rad. But this day is going to be crazy because I've got to get my snake work done and everything else. And then I'm hitting the road about noon to head down to Columbus, Ohio to meet up with my friends at the Columbus, Ohio Zoo. Unfortunately, we're not going to be able to film a lot of stuff there, but we'll still take you guys along on the adventure. And then I'm meeting up with Kerry King from the band Slayer. We're going to go check out the Slayer concert tonight in Columbus, Ohio. And then we drive all the way back home. I woke up at 5 a.m. this morning and I won't get home till about 4 a.m. tonight. So it's going to be a really long day, but it's going to be an awesome one. What do you say we get this day started? Like I've mentioned before, feeding big snakes is always exciting. So we're going to feed Lucy, Daisy, and our new albino berm today. So uh, uh, what do you say we get this started? It's gonna be so cool. Ready to eat. Oh. <laughs> Look at how gentle she took it. How awesome is that? In English, please. You pooped in the refrigerator. Okay, so next up is the new albino Burmese python. She looks like she's hungry, so I have a feeling she's gonna eat with no problem. Let's see how it goes. Mm -hmm. Yep, she was hungry. And look at Daisy. Daisy's like, when is my turn? Daisy, you're up next. The new snake is being a little bit camera shy, so it won't eat, so I just went ahead and closed this cage. But I think Lucy's ready for another one. Oh. And next up will be Daisy, and she is really looking hungry, so uh, I am gonna do my best to keep my hand out of the way. Woo! <laughs> that was exciting. Hey guys, how's it going for you today? Hopefully pretty good. Today here at the shop, it's super crazy, super hectic. Brian's not here and uh, our secretary Tina is off today too. So I'm covering a lot of bases and I'm going crazy trying to do it, but we'll get it done because that's what I do. But that being said, I've already got the orders and everything ready to go. Now I have to get some animal work done. So off to do some waters in the Calubrids. Speak Spanish in English, please. So as I'm doing these waters, I'm sitting here thinking about how I do things and why I do things. And I'm not gonna lie, I'm a kind of person who does not like to waste time when it comes to anything I'm doing, whether it's stuff at home, at work, I try to get the max amount of work done in the least amount of time. It's just how I am. That being said, I can, when I do these, you know, a lot of people do one cage at a time, you know, one row at a time. I like to rock these out two rows at a time, two cages at a time. I get it done half the time. I don't know if you guys are like that or not, or if that's something that you try to do, but I don't know, fun fact, that's how I roll. 
Well, these boxes don't make themselves. One more thing off my list. Okay guys, so I, I know I've been all over the place today, but that's kind of how my day's been going. And honestly, that's usually how a lot of my days go. But I'm used to it, that's kind of how my life is, and I honestly don't mind it. I know sometimes I seem stressed or, you know, way over busy, and, and that is true sometimes. Other times, that's just how I am and how I deal with things. I wouldn't change it. I'm kind of wired that way, like I'm not kind of person that would do good like with boring life, just kind of mellow and stuff. Being on task and having a lot to do kind of keeps me going. Um, and then, you know, when I get home, I can decompress and, and relax and do stuff too. So that's pretty much how I'm wired. So, you know, another little inside tip as far as into the life of Lori, but I like it and that's why I keep doing it. So I hope the rest of your guys' day goes good and I hope things are going good with Brian wherever he is and whatever he's doing and I'm sure we'll be seeing you soon. All right, so we are heading to Columbus, Ohio. Of course, Noah is coming with me. This is his first Slayer concert or metal concert all together. He's more of a hip hop, you know, rap type guy. So uh, I am dragging him out to Slayer and he's gonna get the first time experience. And it is super cool that his first metal concert is gonna be backstage hanging out with the band. So uh, we're gonna put his entire vlog, it's gonna be on his channel. I'll link it down in the description. I'm just gonna give you guys a little overview of what's going on. On, but he's gonna be vlogging every step of the way so make sure to check his video out but uh we've got about three and a half hours to go first we're gonna hook up with my buddy Steve the guy that has that really cool aquarium shop and then we're on the road all right you guys probably remember this I'm at my boy Steve Bashies he's the guy with the big acrylic shop for light support for fish tanks he builds all the life support and tanks for the show tank on Animal Planet so uh this place is absolutely rad I brought Joey from DIY here to check the place out I've been here a bunch of times I love this place. So Steve is coming with me down to the Slayer concert because we always hook up for Slayer and all the shows around here. So it's going to be absolutely cool. So just waiting on him. I'm alone in the shop right now. So if you guys want anything, just let me know and I'll take it and ship it to you. You know, you guys need some aquarium stuff? Hey, man, look at this. I don't even know what these things are, but uh, hey, we could ship them to you if you guys want. <laughs> but anyways, just waiting for him, and then as soon as he gets here, we're out of here. All right, guys, so we made it down to the Columbus Zoo. You can see the zoo water thing in the off -shoot. This is actually the promotions department. Now, there's really not a lot of filming that I can do here, but I'll try to take a few pictures, maybe film a couple little things if at all possible. But regardless, I can't do a lot of filming here, but uh, maybe we'll go into the zoo later, and we'll see what happens. But I'm definitely going to be meeting some really cool animals, and I'll definitely post some pictures on my Instagram page that you can check out. Link will be in the description, or follow at at Snake Bites TV. Regardless, maybe I'll film a couple things. We'll see what they let me get away with. All right, so now we're in the main part of the Columbus Zoo. Here's a couple pictures that I posted on Instagram of things I saw in the promotions department. Absolutely insane. It's so much fun. This zoo is absolutely one of the coolest zoos I've been to, and up here is actually the Africa exhibit, and uh, there's actually a lion right over here, just kind of chilling by the glass. Oh my God, take a look at this. Take a look at this. Oh my gosh, there's a whole bunch of them. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I said it's like a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, before I head to the Slayer concert, I gotta go visit my favorite animal. Of course, giraffes. I love giraffes, and look at them over here. Oh, that is so awesome. <laughs> How awesome is that? Oh, okay. Hey, bud. What's up? I love it. <laughs> I absolutely love giraffes. They're so awesome. <laughs> All right, so we had a good little tour of the zoo. It was absolutely amazing. I love zoos so much, but hey, we are down here not only to check out the zoo, but to head to Slayer. So what do you say we get out of here and go meet up with uh, the boys from Slayer? So we finally made it to the arena for the Slayer concert. I think that there's two opening bands. Uh, I'm not even exactly sure who's playing tonight, but uh, it uh, sounds like it's loud and it's gonna be intense. <laughs> Guys, so we are in between sets. Slayer's about to come on. This is Noah's first metal concert. What do you think so far? I think it's freaking awesome, bro. Headbanging. <laughs> All right, so we need to get Noah up in the pit and do some crowd surfing. And uh, so make sure to check out his vlog because I'm going to make him. You going to do it? 
I don't think I don't really want to die today. Listen, you gotta. It's bad choice, Noah. You gotta just do it, man. Maybe. <laughs> it's gonna be rad. Slayer's up next, so it should be pretty cool. guys so the show is over of course with I'm here with my buddy Kerry and a lot of people don't know that not only is he a badass guitar player but he also runs probably one of the coolest carpet python collections in the world called Psychotic Exotic so what is you excited about anything this year with carpets or what what well, gray bands we talked about too yeah that's a weird one yeah that's, that's, a weird that's one. definitely a guilty pleasure well you used to be a Kluber guy though right I used to be I used to be a jack of all trades and had a lot of everything but didn't specialize in anything mm -hmm. And then I got rid of everything, and then I specialized in carpets with a few guilty pleasures. <laughs> yeah, well, you're doing a good job of it. There's no doubt about that. Carpets this year, I think Todd told me, the only carpet clutch that he's even mentioned to me is um, Caramel Tiger to Caramel Tiger. Oh, well, that's a good one, though. And I think that's the first one. I'm not positive because I'm not as in touch as I once yeah. was. But if it is, you know, we'll be seeing cool Super, car super Caramel um, Tigers, yeah, which that's I'm, I'm excited crazy. to see. Last year, we did red tiger to red tiger mm -hmm. and essentially got the same thing okay. so we got super reds right are they, are they sick or what they're ridiculous <laughs> they're well, ridiculous well guys i definitely will link down in the description his awesome collection of snakes you got to check it out and uh you know again Kerry, just thanks for having us out man i appreciate it bro yeah man I wish I could have done something better about the weather, but hey. No, no, it was cool, I brought, man. I brought the fire instead. <laughs> yeah, 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 fire in a warm day. It was perfect. All right, so it is 4 a.m. in the morning, and if you remember at the beginning of this vlog, I got up at 5 in the morning to start my day. So that means the last 23 hours I've been on the go. It is so good to be home, and I've only got a few hours to sleep before I have to wake up because I have a pretty busy day tomorrow, but it was a really good time. Again, I'll link down below in the description Noah's vlog on the whole journey as well so you can see another angle of it but uh what a great time those animals at the zoo were so incredible the snakes back at the shop were great feeding big snakes is always amazing and hanging out with carrie from slayer was always a great time he's such a passionate animal guy and his music is awesome too so i hope you guys enjoyed it thank you so much for watching today you guys mean the world to me and even though i'm tired as could be you guys energize me and i thank you for it can you do me a favor and smash that like button then hit that notification bell for me. Make sure to be kind to somebody and I promise in a few hours I'm going to see you again. <laughs>